Hey everyone, so I'm in my HRV because I'm here to feature this product that was sent to me by one of my sponsors to be reviewed. Now this little thing right here will plug right into your cigarette lighter or AC port that some people call it. Once you do that, you will have the capability of charging up your devices. Now this little white ball looking thing on top that you see right here, it works with this little round circle that you see down here. So this is a motion sensor and this is a speaker. So this unit is actually a motion detecting alarm system. So once you arm it with the included remote and the remote looks like this, so it will fit nicely on your keychain. Then it's going to trigger this 110 decibel speaker that you see right here to try to scare away the person who's trying to break inside your vehicle. Now I know all these new cars on the market now have some type of alarm system built in and some of them immobilize the engine so it doesn't matter if they try to break into the car or not unless they have the key fob they still couldn't start the engine. But this is another level of protection. I mean, you cannot have too much protection. Now it's fairly simple to install. As a matter of fact, there's no installation. All you have to do is just plug it into the cigarette lighter or your AC port. And then when you exit your vehicle, you just hit the button on the remote and then it's gonna be armed. You come back, hit the button again, it's disarmed. Now this device wouldn't be any useful to you if it doesn't work while the car is off. Luckily the manufacturer was thinking about that too. So there's a rechargeable battery that's built into this that lasts up to six days. So if you park your car for a while, as long as it's not over six days, then you have some internal protection with this device. So the real question is, how well does it work? So let's try arming it. There you go, now it's armed. So we're going to just wave my hand around to see it goes off. And then you just press the button to disarm it when it does. So it does detect motion. But that's inside the car. What if I'm somebody on the outside just peeping in just to see what's inside so I can steal? Will it still detect my motion while I'm peeping through the glass? Let's see. Okay, as you can see, it will detect motion inside the vehicle. But once you step outside the vehicle, even if you walk by, you touch the glass, it's still not going to detect motion. So this device is very near field. That means you have to be real close to it for it to be triggered, which is kind of understandable because if you're in a parking garage and somebody walk past your car, especially, you know, with these tight park garage where somebody's real close to you, as soon as they get out their vehicle and this detect their motion, it's just going to constantly going off. So I see where they're coming from when they were designing that as far as how far it can detect motions. But it would be nice if somebody was actually that close to the glass where it would detect their motion. But then again, I don't know how well that would work if you had tinted glass. But here's the thing though, if somebody's able to break in and this thing goes off, it's not gonna let you know that somebody broke in because it's not integrated with an app so it can send you a notification to let you know that somebody broke in your vehicle. But like I said, it's another added deterrent to try to protect your vehicle. All right, so I'm gonna leave a link in the description to this car motion detector alarm system that plugs right into your AC port. It comes with a remote and it's made by Technex. All right, so I wanna thank you for taking the time for watching this video. Have a good one and I'll see you next time.